Hey guys, welcome back. We're being sniffed out by a dog, but he's too dumb to see us in this little box. In this part, we should be completing this act because we only have to do this catapult mini game. We just need to not get caught. If he wakes up, I'm just going to run for it. That should be, yep, we're far away enough for him to not pay any attention to us. We have quite a lot of sprouts. I bet we don't even run out of any. Like 35 will last us till the end of the game. Alright. Is Mr. Tweedy in this area? Because he was in the other area, now he? I think he is in this area. Yo, baby doll. Rocky. Oh, <laughs> that was the whole conversation. Alright. Now it's uh, hut 15 we go, which is only an area B, so we probably won't get caught by anybody. And this mini game isn't that hard, so we should do it first time. Shouldn't have a problem. At last, I found everything you need. Brilliant. That will finish things off nicely. Is the catapult ready to go? Yes, it's outside facing the lake now. Did you hear the way she said brilliant? That's just... Perfect! Find the chickens onto the objects in the water. Alright. Yeah, she actually just, you just kind of launch them. And that's, that's it. You can make them drown. I think they get out though. No, they don't. They drown. Shit. That is harsh. <laughs> I thought they used to get out on the side of a lake. But... Oh my god, they actually drown. That. That. Probably would not be allowed today. That would. That would. This would be. Banned in Australia. I didn't. I didn't realize they drowned. Well, you don't know if they drown or not. Maybe they hold their breath for a long time. But we all know that that's probably not true. Just three more to get. Oops, sorry guy, you're dead. My bad. <laughs> Did I do that? Okay. Got them all, I'm just gonna wait now because this mini game isn't very fun. Time's up. I think if you get gold medals in every single mini game, you get something at the end of the game, just like an extra scene from the film or just a, some concept art or something and save the game. Definitely want to save. Time on this at 16 minutes. <sighs> well, so it's like 26 minutes altogether spent on this game. However, it's actually probably longer than this Let's Play because that 16 minutes is from me playing the game without recording because of how it froze and I had to redo it. So, here we are at the end of the acts level. It's the, it's the chicken pie machine, or as Mr. Tweedy thinks, it's the apple pie machine. I like how the... Uh, I just want to show you this. I like how the music is all really happy, and then if you get... If you die, it just suddenly turns really dramatic. And, yeah, getting crushed to death doesn't really kill you, it just knocks you out. So yeah, you're supposed to bounce on the dough here. Not sure if that happened in the film. Probably not. I'm pretty sure they actually got stuck in the dough. Like, they got their feet stuck in it. So This is not true to the movie. 2 out of 10. But this level is actually not half bad. Oh, as soon as I cross this, I'm going to have to... Uh, make sure the laptop doesn't turn itself off. Okay. If you actually... I when I remember when I did this the first time when I because I 
didn't get off the platform that moved and it started moving backwards and I was like, oh my god, why is it doing this? And then, because it's going backwards, it's a lot harder to not get killed by the blades. And I died. Oh, what the hell? Give me a break. I think it checkpoints, though. The way he dies is though, he just sits down and lies down like he's going to sleep. Oh, what the? I didn't know the gravy killed you. Well, actually, it did. Kind of. Although, I'm pretty sure one time it didn't kill me, so I just kind of went for it. But I was knocked out because I got a drip of gravy on my head. Chickens are, like, allergic to gravy. Alright. Go. Go! Is there another one? Yep. Whoa! Yeah, we did it. Almost at the end. This part's weird because you actually move even though you're not on the actual moving platform. I'm clearly on the normal platform and it's moving quick. Get onto. Oh, I'm not going to make that. It takes a while for them to cook enough piece of dough. Okay, thank you. Whoa! I gotta wait for that piece of dough. And this is the kind of music I could have on my iPod. This is just kick ass tunage. Oh, look, there's Ginger. Boom, we did it. We had another scene from the movie that we're gonna skip. I'm not going to bother saying things. Nobody wants to watch me save the game over and over again. Okay, so because I had skipped the movie cutscene, as always, basically this is the part of the movie where they decide to build the plane and Rocky... They find out Rocky is a fake because he is a fake. Matt, have you been able to do the drawing since we talked to Fowler about the old crate from his RAF days? I only wish we'd listened to his daring war stories more carefully. Paula's provided the answer. Who needs Rocky anyway? Well, hey, I've been working on my calculations. And I think the idea of a flying machine will work. Excellent. I knew we'd be able to fly out of here. Let's see it. Well, here are my plans for the old crate. It has to be big to hold us all, but I've broken it down into three main components. We'll have to get all three built and working before we can fly over the fence. Freedom. Oh, I can almost feel that grass under my feet. We need to the mother listening to all the plans. No, you coordinate the plan. Now we do we do actually need quite a lot, but I don't think it's much more than we had in part in Act Two. I know. Those rats always want eggs. Well, I'll go and see Bunty in Hut Two. She'll be well chuffed that she can help. Oh, well chuffed she will be. That's so British and silly. Yeah, there's a disco ball. That wasn't there before. Oh, and it's night time again. And, yeah. It's kind of cool how they actually decorated this place, like, with all the lights on the walls, because that actually happened in the film. You know, at least they paid a little bit of attention to the detail. And you can actually turn the radio on. Don't know if you can hear it. It's nothing interesting, though. Need to turn it off again. And I'm going to end this part here because I want to. I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.